This is a tale that you humans have passed down through uncounted generations. Okay, maybe I should move my head. Hi. Hello. Tales of a war of unmatched scale, a ferocity that like of which would never be seen. Like, give me a second to move. Thank you. One dark, fateful day, the earth cracked wide and malevolent forces rushed out from it. Wow. That looks like the original version of how Ganon was designed. Gee, I wonder why. They mounted a brutal assault upon the surface people, driving the land into deep despair. Whoa. They burnt forests to ash. Clo choked the land's sweet springs and murdered without. Whoa. Dark. That, that is dark. <laughs> um, well, while there's no dialogue, how's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back aboard the Nostalgic Train. They did all this in their lust to take the ultimate power, protected by her grace, the goddess. Hi, Leah. And her harp. Can't forget her harp. The power she guarded with out as without equal. Handed down by gods of old, this power gave its holder the means to make any desire a reality. Hmm. Such was the might of the ultimate power that the old ones placed it in the care of the goddess. To prevent this great power from falling into the hands of the evil swarming land, the land, the evil, wow. The goddess gathered the surviving humans on an outcropping of earth. She sent it skyward, beyond the reach of the demonic hordes, beyond even the clouds. Okay, cool. Cool. Cool, man. Without the humans, with the humans safe, the goddess joined forces with the land dwellers and fought the evil forces. At last, peace was restored to the surface. Oh, well, that's good to know. <laughs> For now. I'm gonna make sure that's actually it. This is a tale that you humans have told for many ages, generation to generation. But there are other legends, long hidden away from memory, that are intertwined with this tale. Now, a new legend bound to this great story stands ready to be revealed. A legend that will be forged by your own hand. Cool. Cool. A legend that I've been holding off for way too long because I hated the Wii version. How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and it didn't work. It was delayed. Of course it was. <laughs> Welcome to The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. I'm used to playing this version because I'd rather the version with the controller. Creating save data, yay. Cool. All right, so let's get started. Link, of course I'm gonna play as Link. What, what kind of question is this? What do we got? Hello! You, you look like, you, you look like you're hungry. Uh, I, 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 I ain't got no food. Nintendo presents. Legend of Zelda. So, what, now we're, now we're doing Skyward Sword. I don't remember it being presented like this. That. Red loft wing. Blue loft wing. Where's the white loft wing? Or the green loft wing? Or yellow? White, white, green, or yellow? I'll let you decide. Hi, Zelda. A 
Okay, whoever voiced Zelda in this game, beautiful, beautiful voice. Beautiful singing voice. I know quite a few better, but <laughs> Only faintly see it though. Um, why am I in a pitch black zone? This is not the. Oh, I do. Why is it I say, why am I in pitch black and then you make it purple? Rise, Link. The time has come for you to awaken. You are fated to have a hand in a great destiny, and it will soon find you. The time has come for you to awaken. We're not playing Leak's Awakening. We will. But we're not doing it yet. Oh, hello. Like always, with every Zelda game, I have a walkthrough in front of me, uh, just in case I need it. Whoa! Hello! Whoa! Um... Ex 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 squeeze me. Squ squeeze me real twi twight next time. <laughs> maybe, 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 maybe that won't scare the heebie bejeebies out of my face. <laughs> to you too. <sighs> next time you wake me up, could you just squeeze my belly button? <laughs> just. Come on, pe pe just start pecking my belly button if you can't squeeze it. Just... Oh, right. Um... Hey, hey, sleepyhead. I know how much you like to sleep in, so I'm guessing this letter will be your alarm clock this morning. Did I guess right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Link is asleep every single time. <laughs> I can't name one Zelda game where Link doesn't wake up. That's not the original two. Rise and shine, Link. Today's the wing ceremony. You promise to meet me before it starts, remember? Oh, shit. Um, I might get in trouble for this. You better not keep me waiting. Zelda. Oh, boy. That was a cute response, Link. I'll give you that. It, it took me a while to get used to these kind of controls. But they're all, in my opinion, they're a lot better than motion controls. Personal opinion. You found a blue r ruby. It's worth five. No, oh, I didn't know that. I've been playing like 20,000 Zelda games. Actually, how many Zelda games are there? <laughs> um, Zelda, could you come help me? I'm aware of this. I appreciate the guide. Hey, Link. The day of the wing ceremony is finally upon us. It's time to put what you've learned to use. All those practical skills I taught you and all the academic prowess Instructor Horwell taught you. While we're at it, do you remember how to look around using... Uh... Yes. I'm doing it right now. I'm... Um, what... If I can, can I, can I bend down? Well, well I'm just gonna look, I'm, I'm gonna look at Pippin's butt. Pippin's got a nice butt. Just look, look at, look at that juicy thing. <laughs> no. <laughs> Let's see how many nice butts I can see around here. Hi. Um, shoot. Fledge. Fledge. I forgot your name for a second. Time to look at your butt. Oh, just look at Fledge. There we go. Now, what are you doing, Fledge? Fledge. Fledge. Do you really have to be doing that out here? The, out here is not... This is... That is not the... Fledge! Come on, bro! Just, <laughs> oh. Oh, I don't want motion controls on. Hold on. Uh... No. Do not use motion controls. Fledge! Dude, that is just not, that is, that's just, bro, why am I watching it? That's my big question. Why am I? Why was it? 
I am probably watching the most... It, this is how you do it, you butthole. Fee, fi, fo, fum. Come and kiss my booty's drum. I actually got two booty drums. They're both just stomping back and forth. <laughs> Uh, uh, put it down. I don't want the barrel crushing my thighs. Use legs, not ch stomach, chest. Use legs, not back. Hey! There you go. Did the barrel just phase right through you? What's all this? I thought I told Fudge to carry that. Bah! It's probably for the best. The skinny boy would probably have gotten flattened. Say, don't you have some important ceremonies or some such today? <laughs> well, thanks for the help. Uh, I don't know whether you're thanking me or if you're disgusted by me. Also, but, no, but, you know what, no. That, that, that butt ain't looking so good. Never mind. <laughs> there you go, dude. Thanks! That was a huge help, Link! I know it's not much, but here's half of the pay the old lady offered me to do that. My first red rupee of the game! I have to hang back and watch the academy today. Good luck with the ceremony, Link. Thanks. And the gate is closed. I'm not supposed to get out. I don't even know. Ultimate butt right there. I gotta see the statue's butt. That's the ultimate. Hey. What? Hey, Link, up here. Hi. Yo. Good morning to you, Link. Today's finally the day of the long-awaited wing ceremony. Are you feeling ready? Oh. I just remembered. There's something I'd like to ask you about. Target me, and we can have a quick chat. There you go. Excellent. Always remember you can target someone to talk to them easily. And even when there isn't anything to target, it's a convenient way to quickly face your few... Yeah? Oh. That's a little silly to carry on a conversation from the distance. Why don't you come up and join up me up here? Normal Zelda mechanics. You should be able to climb up if you dash up to the top of the, that wooden box, don't you think? Then you can make that jump fairly easily. Try climbing up here. I know. Hey! Okay, Professor Horwell, do not turn around. No, I, 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 I but, 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 Horwell! I... Uh, you're not gonna let me go butt searching, are you? So, what are you up to? Rushing to get some last minute bird riding practice in the morning- in this morning, Link? Oh? You have someone to meet? Ah, Zelda waiting for you, is she? Perfect timing, then. You see, Zelda's father, Headmaster Gapora, has a pet named Mia. And, well, she scampered off again. Great. Look. Over there. Do you see her? The headmaster is so busy working with Zelda preparing for the ceremony. I thought that maybe I should feed her. But the ceremony is about to start and I just put on a fresh set of clothes. And, well, you see. Will you help me out and go retrieve Mia for me? Sure. Fantastic. So you'll do it? I know you're in a hurry, so I really appreciate you taking the time to help. You're welcome. I like helping people. Helping people's the best. It's most of the time. You should be able to climb up somewhere over there. If you hang off that ledge there, you can climb onto the roof from the other side. I'm terribly sorry, but I know you're quite the climber. I really do appreciate it. You're welcome. I appreciate the fact that you're able to thank me for it. Uh, oh my. We're going 
going to be coming on this rooftop quite a couple of times throughout this playthrough, I believe. If I remember correctly, I think it's like three times, to be honest. Not that bad. Alright, Mia, come here. Come here, kitty. Uh, raccoon. Uh, thing. What are you? What is this thing? K kitty raccoon thing. Here, I'm gonna put you down. Hold still. Hold still. Wait, 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 wait. Now I can see your t kitty tail and its butthole. Wait. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. There. Now I can see its butt. <laughs> I've been, I, I've been, I've been butt searching for some time. I don't know why. It's weird. It, it's, it's a weird hobby that apparently I have now, without me even knowing I had it. <laughs> nice work. You brought her back safe and sound. Sorry for your troubling you with this. I know you're busy, Link. I suppose I should be Mia now. Please tell the headmaster that we found his pet. He should be out by the statue of the goddess. Will do. I believe Zelda is there with him. So you should hurry along. Oh yes. I should give you a reward. It's not much. But please take this. Uh, don't tell the others. More money. I'm taking my. I'm taking this. Down. This is mine. Look. This is the ultimate butt right here. I thought the statue would be. But this is the ultimate butt. I'm just taking this with me now. See ya. <laughs> the ultimate fantabulous butt of a uh what is this thing <laughs> there we go perfect okay fine i'll let you down here we go Hi, Zelda. Oh, youth guided by the servant of the goddess. Unite earth and sky. Bring light to the land. Hi, Zelda. Hey! Good morning, Link! Hi! I'm glad to see my loft wing got you out of bed. <laughs> what else is new? I was pretty sure you'd sleep in and forget to meet me this morning. <laughs> but look at this instrument! And look at this outfit! They're mine to use today in the ceremony since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Aren't they beautiful? Especially this instrument. They tell me it's just like the one the goddess was said to have in the legends. It sounds gorgeous, too. I asked Father about it, and he says it's called a harp. Yeah, pfft. A hand harp. A handheld harp, to be more specific, but yeah. And look at these clothes. I made this wrap myself, and we get to use it in today's ceremony. Between the harp and this outfit, I'm going to make a great goddess today. I got you up early this morning because I wanted you to be the first to see me like this, Link. Aww. That's cute. <laughs> so, how do I look? I'm not even... This shouldn't even be a question. Those two are definitely bound to be together in the long haul. Huh, <laughs> I think so too. But it's nice to know you agree. Thanks, Link. Cute couple. Ah, there you are, Zelda. Are you all prepared for today's ceremony? Oh, hello, Father. That's the voice I should have been getting Zelda in the first place. Ah, Link. You're here too. Outstanding! It's encouraging to see you up so early, given your capacity for sleep. <laughs> no doubt today's ceremony had you too excited to close your eyes for once. Zelda, please don't tell him. If you win today's ceremonial race, you'll get to participate in the post-race ritual with Zelda. So give it your best out there. Yeah, 
us about that. Zelda, I know what you're about to say. Don't. Don't. Father, I don't know if he can do it. Ouch. Ouch. That, that expression right there pretty much says it. That, uh, that expression honestly should say how I... W w it should be the response to what I've been doing this entire episode. Zelda, could you turn around? I need to see that butt. Kapora, you too. Look, I'm a butt addict. I don't know where it came from. <laughs> Recently, Link hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. And even when he's out riding his loft wing, he's just lazily gliding around. Probably daydreaming. Hey! Is that such a bad thing? Hey, look at Link's face. It's okay, Link. Don't worry. It's, it's, it's fine. Don't worry, Link. You're gonna win. It really is not that hard. Especially since I don't have to worry about motion controls this time. I don't know what he's thinking. He's going to have to be in perfect control of his bird to win today. I, I, I'm offended. <laughs> no need to worry yourself, Zelda. Though you may have a point, today's wing ceremonies tests the skill of the rider as well as his bond to his bird. Victory will not come easily. I'm pretty dang sure it's impossible for the other CPUs to win. This isn't, this isn't Mario Kart. And as you, as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students. But you've known him since you were both very little. You should know better than to fret about him. You see, Link and his loft... loft <laughs> Link and his loft wing have very nice butts, as the player of here is probably trying to say, because he can't seem to get his mind out of the fucking gutter. <laughs> hey! Hold on a second! I'm just kidding, that's all it says. You see, Link and his loft wing share a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. As you know, each of us in Skyloft is but one half of a pair. We are only made whole by our loft wings, the guardians birds that the goddess bestows upon each of us as a symbol of her divine protection. Huh, nice. When we are young, every one of us meets our loft wing under the great statue of the goddess. It's quite a big moment, as I'm sure you recall. Ah, but the first meeting between Link and his loft wing was extraordinary. Yeah, you can see it in Hyrule Historia. It's interesting, that's for dang sure. The bird that came to him was a crimson loftwing. It is a breed so rare, we were sure for some time that it had vanished from the line. I think he was being like tortured by Groose when it happened or something. Yes, and the boy and his bird seemed to share a profound connection from the moment they met. Do you, re do you recall when Link and that loftwing of his first met? What a sight. The little boy just hopped up on that bird and gracefully flew away, without even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. Judging by how jealous you were that day, I'd say the friendship he shared with his bird didn't go unnoticed by you, my dear. And now he's just looking for... And the problems emerge. Where is my damn lost wing? Ah, <laughs> uh, but who can blame you? I'm sure you weren't the only one envious of the powerful bonds shared by Link and his bird. Anyone who is a part of something special is bound to catch some nasty looks sooner or later. <laughs> you know, I know you're, you're, you're part... This contest is nothing to laugh at, father. This ceremony is part of the final test for those training to become Knights of Skyloft. Okay, alright, jeez. If Link doesn't fly fast enough during the race... What if Link messes up his big chance? What if he's not allowed to become a knight? 
Um, calm down, my dear. It will be fine. Honestly, it's almost as though you become a completely different person when you worry about Link. Whew. Hey. Listen, Link, you'd better fly your heart out today. At the very least, you need to squeeze in a little practice time before the race. Come on. You'll thank me later. Uh... Ha <laughs> ha! Zelda? 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 Look, I know I'm a butt act, but is this really necessary? What the heck are you doing? Uh, uh, are, 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 are you done circulating my body? Look, only I'm, I, I, I am the only one allowed to be addicted to butts, okay? No, I'm not, but, you know. <laughs> I... <laughs> I've got a problem. Here we are. Go on now. Jump off the edge and call your loft win. It's almost time for the ceremony. So try to practice seriously for once. Hmm? Oh yeah? You can't sense your bird out of there? Out there? Oh, I get it. You're trying to weasel out of having to practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. Zelda, Zelda, Zelda. Don't. Zelda. Off you go. Whoa! Okay. Okay, Link. Go ahead. Just press blog and call... Uh... 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 Hmm. This bird sure is taking a long time to get here. Something's wrong. Yeah, no kidding! <sighs> okay, I didn't even get the chance to read that, but whatever it was... I'm sure it was Zelda apologizing or something like that. Do all right. I'm sorry, friend. I didn't mean to push you so hard. You didn't sprain your wing, did you? This is very odd, Link. What could have possibly happened to your loft wing? Oh, I know. I know, and I don't like it. For a bird to ignore the call of his master? It's unheard of. You still can't sense your bird nearby, Link? Hey, Link? This is quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony is about to start. Yeah, uh, can we delay it? Link, when you said you couldn't sense your loft wing... Oh, that's Zelda. Link, when you said you couldn't sense your, your loft wing, well, I should have believed you. I'm sorry. Eh, it's fine. I need to tend to my own loft wing, so I'll catch up with you later. You'd better go on ahead and see if you can find where your bird has gone. Um... That's the ding-dong of a big problem. My, how did it get to be so late? If I recall correctly, this year Instructor Horwell is presiding over the ceremony. Link, you should go explain the situation to him and see if he's willing to delay the race a little so that you can find your bird. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. But Father, you're the headmaster of the academy. If Link asks the instructor Howell, he'll probably just come talk to you about it. Yeah? Ah, quite true. As usual, you make an excellent point, my dear. Very well, I'll explain the situation to him myself. Link, run along and tell instructor Howell to come see me in my quarters. I feel like I'm about to sneeze. Wait, hold on. Before we do anything, I... Bird butt. Before we do anything, bird butt. <laughs> Can't really look at Zelda's, though. It's kind of hidden. Wait, wait, what? Ah, there we are. Okay, let's go, 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 go. I like, I really do like the music here. Hello. Is something wrong? What's the big hurry? What? Your loft wing is missing? But I just saw him. Bruce's bird was chasing off after your feather fell. What? 
Okay, where's Groose? Oh, Groose and his little cronies were saying they were headed down to the wing ceremony in the plaza. Oh, you still trying to get down to the south end? That X mark on your map, that's the plaza. I kind of figured. It's where they're holding the wing ceremony today, so you'll definitely want to find it before too long. So, my guess is they might be in the plaza. Normally, the fastest way there is just down this path. But you're blocking it off. But this gate here still seems... Still needs some work before it'll open. Can you go around to the academy? Remember to check the map with blah to get lost. If you get lost, yep, I know. Alright, Groose, you're getting punched. Hi. Yo. What's wrong, Link? You're looking a little pale. What? Your loft wing is missing? How strange and troubling. Do you think you can find him? You're going to start looking for him now? How will you make it back in time to fly in the ceremony? Looks like your participation in the ceremony hinges on whether or not you can find the... <sighs> really, Nintendo? <clears throat> Excuse me. I see. So the headmaster has summoned me? Alright then. I'll go speak with him immediately. I still owe you for helping me out earlier, so don't worry about the ceremony for now. You focus on finding your loft wing. Thank you. I appreciate it. I really do. Now, let's see. Ooh. I want this. Yeah, that's the only reason I got that. <laughs> Ooh, and first green rupee of the game. Can I get a, what are they, yellow? 10, 10 is yellow, right? 10 is yellow, I think. I'll see you in just a sec, kid. Hold up, I can't go in there right now, Never mind. Hey, kid. Hold up, Link. Hey, hey, Link! Could you help me with something? All you have to do is dash and roll into the tree. Just like I've been doing. Dash, then when you're in front of the tree, BAM! Do a roll right into it. So come on, please! Alright, alright, alright. Whoa! You did it! A sky stag beetle! Wait up! Um. Well, alright then. You right, kid? Ah, poor kid. Aww, my sky stag beetle. So close. Oh well. To catch it, I would need a bug net anyway. I wish I hadn't thrown out the one I bought at Beetle's Air Shop. Aww. Why would you do that? That just sounds stupid. <sighs> Those butts are just hideous. I don't like those ones. Those are the only ones I wouldn't look at. Hi. Hi. Hey, Link. How's it going? The wing ceremony is about to begin, right? Remember when Pip Pit won the last one right at the last second? It was so close. Now that was a race. Yeah, this one won't be. Hey, the Crimson Loftwing will be in the race, right? I'm looking forward to seeing what he can do. Yeah, he will, once I deal with these idiots. You know, Chris, that sure was a pain, what with all the scratching and pecking. Of <laughs> course it was. You thought a big crimson loft wing like that would go, was going to go down without a fight? <laughs> but we got him. And I don't care how tough those birds are supposed to be. He's not getting out of that pen anytime soon, boys. Hey! Whoa! Link! So, uh, yeah. So long have you been standing there? Long enough to hear what you just said. What's your problem anyway? Oh, wait. I got it. You are a butt addict! What has been going on in your head? You need to stop just staring, you know? <laughs> okay, that's just getting old at this point. 
I got it. You're here to talk about today's race. I can see it in those dopey eyes of yours. They're pleading- Oh, Groose, can you please find it in your heart to let me win today? Please? You're just desperate to win so you can get some alone time with Zelda up on the statue of the goddess at the end of the ceremony. <laughs> Hi. Well, sorry, pal. Groose doesn't do charity for wimps. My advice? Work hard and wish with all your heart. You might even come in second. Say, come to think of it, how come I don't see your bird? Where is that scruffy pile of red feathers? Can't imagine that could have, what could have happened to him. Do you think his tiny brain got confused by all the clouds and got lost? Okay, fight me. <laughs> sure. Only thing is, I don't know how you're going to do that with no bird. You gonna grow wings? You know, we're all getting tired of how you never let anyone forget you and Zelda go way back. Actually, I think you just hold a grudge against that. You've been friends since you were kids? Big deal! It doesn't change the fact that you float through life with your head in the clouds. Don't, technically don't all of us. <laughs> Would you wake up, straighten up, and grow a backbone already? Why do you think I said bring it on? Dopes like you were dragging our honored academy through the mud. And just who might you be talking about, Groose? Oh, uh, Z Zelda. Hey, nah, it's, uh... Oh my, yeah, don't make her angry. Don't even try it, Groose. You're picking on Link again, aren't you? He's a student at the Academy, like all of us. We know he has a butt problem, but seriously, you've got to stop picking on him. No. Oh. Why do you insist on bullying him all around so much? You literally just said the reason, Zelda. <laughs> it's not a good reason, but... No, no reason's a good reason, but still. Y yeah, I, I, I suppose. Suppose? Suppose what? Oh boy. I suppose you. Uh, uh. <sighs> Pfft, forget it. I was supposing nothing, okay? Alright. Okay, we're out of here, boys! Later, Link. Hope you find your bird, or else you're gonna have to sit out today's race. Ah, screw you! That could be a major setback toward knighthood. So find that bird, or get real used to this taste of failure. It's your special flavor. Get. Out. I hate to say it. But I'm beginning to suspect that those blockheads had something to do with your loft wings disappearing. No, nah, really? Never would have guessed that one. Link, those guys aren't going to help us find your bird, so we better start searching. I'll fly around Skyloft and see if I can spot any trace of your bird. I already know where the bird is, I just need a sword. Father said he'd talk to Instructor Holwell about delaying the ceremony of the wing ceremony. Delaying the start of the wing ceremony, so don't worry, we'll find your bird in time. Yay! Bye. Ooh, ooh, but, but, night, ooh. In all reality, the only one girl's butt I'll look at is my fiance's. That's it. <laughs> but this is a game. And Link's the one looking at butts, not me, I swear it. Don't judge me. Whoa, hello. What's wrong, Link? What? Your loft wing is. Missing? That's terrible. I was so looking forward to seeing that red blur streak through the sky. No, no, no. I haven't seen him. Hmm. Why don't you look for him by the statue of the goddess? You'll have a good view of the whole town from way up there. The statue of the goddess is the great big sta- I know where it is. Well, thanks, game, for telling me where to go next. Um... 
We'll go ahead and do that. We'll go ahead and head towards the statue of the goddess, and then once we've talked to the statue of the goddess, I think I'll do one other thing, and then after that I'll leave the video off to where it is. Wherever it might be. I don't know. I'm having too much fun butt-staring. Oh, jeez. Link, you're rubbing off on me. Even though it's basically me too. Oh, it's open now. Got a stamina flower. Hey, Link! Yep, yeah, well, wait, what? Over here! I have some information about your loft wing. Come over here! Okay. Oh! Oh! Whoops. Well, it was bound to happen at some point in this playthrough. <laughs> Watch your step there. You can't always depend on knights like me to swoop you in and save you. Hey. Sorry! That was an accident! Hey, Pippet. What's up? Hey, Link! I was just looking for you. I heard your loft wing has gone missing, so I thought I'd join in the search. And get this, when I asked Fledge what he knew, he started acting weird. Fledge! I'm so sorry, Link. I really wanted to tell you, but if Groose found out I told you, you're a wuss. It sounds like Groose forced him to keep quiet about it. Go on. Tell him the truth. Just a little while ago, when I was cleaning the dining hall, Groose and his buddies came in. They didn't notice I was there and started talking about their plan to hide your Loftwing. I wanted to warn you, Link. Just as I tried to sneak away, Bruce and his gang grabbed me. They said if I told you, they'd make sure I would never be able to ride a bird ever again. How is that even possible? It sounds like Bruce and his buddies had a plan to capture your bird and hide him near a waterfall. Well, near a waterfall would mean... Quick, let's take a look at your map. I know where it is. That's it, right there. I think it means the waterfall marked here with the X. Yep. Uh, forgive me, Link. I can't help but being such a coward. I'm really sorry. Eh. First of all, sparring hall, we need to grab a sword. After the sword, we'll stop. Okay. Let's get nuts in this chest and go. I don't really need the practice. Hey, Link! You can't take swords outside of the sparring hall. What do you think you're doing sneaking out with that? Um, about that. What? Your loft wing is missing? You want to go look for it? Well, I guess I can make an exception just this once. But remember that Skyleft is a peaceful place. Only knights carry swords. So I don't want to see you swinging it around like crazy out there. I don't want to get in a ton of trouble over this. So here's the deal. Make sure you get plenty of practice on these logs first. Once you get outside with that sword, only use it when you absolutely have to. Got, have to. got it? Yeah, I think I'm good without the practice. I know what I'm doing. Thanks, though. Bye-bye. Plus, I'll be coming back later. <sighs> well, that being said... Um... What was I gonna say? What was I gonna say? I, I lost my train of thought. This is kind of bad for a first episode. Um... Oh, right, that. I'm gonna leave this video here. So, uh, we'll go after Link's Loftwing over there. Or, meh, next time. But again, in the meantime, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Apparently, I can't go too long without doing a Zelda game. Eh. But if you guys like this video, Make sure to push that like button, and so far you can't sit anymore. 
make sure to check out this guy's butt because it looks real good. Not, you know, not really. I mean, where even is it? I feel like it's just like the torso and then legs. There's like no butt there. Anyway, I digress. If you really like this video, consider subscribing to the channel if you have not yet. Um, want to check out any other Zelda games that I've done prior to this one? There's like a lot at this point. Click the link across right here. Or if you want to check out any of the stops on this ride, once there's more than one, top right hand corner and try to take you to one of those two destinations. In the meantime, this train's off to its next destination, but we hope to catch you guys in another ride. Bye!